Learn how to make people more attractive by dilating pupils using Photoshop. The idea behind dilating pupils is when someone's eyes are more dilated, they appear more attractive. It's actually a common trick used in photography and videography to create this mesmerizing look in person's eyes. It can be a useful trick in certain situations such as in portrait photography or in marketing materials like advertisements in the beauty and fashion industry to draw attention towards their products. And the good news is you can achieve the same effect using the Photoshop liquify tool. This can be done easily in just few simple steps. First open your image in Photoshop. Duplicate the layer by pressing Ctrl plus J on your keyboard. Now convert layer to a smart object by right clicking on the layer and selecting convert to smart object. This is important because it allows you to apply non destructive edits and go back to original image if anything goes wrong. Now go to filter menu and select liquify. Select the freeze mask tool. You can find the freeze mask tool in the left hand toolbar of the liquify filter. Once selected, use the brush tool to paint over the areas you want to protect. In this case, we want to protect the eyelashes or size of the eyeball. You can adjust the brush size, density and pressure to achieve the desired effect. Once you have applied the freeze mask tool, any changes you make using other tools in the liquify filter will not affect the masked area. It allows you to work more precisely and efficiently. Now select the blow tool from the liquify filter, set the density to 50. The density determines how much the tool affects the image and the rate to 25. The rate determines the intensity of the effect. When using the blow tool in the liquify filter to enlarge the pupils, it's important to keep the brush size under just under the size of the eyeball. This will help that only the pupils are affected by the tool and not other parts of the eye. Just click once or twice to enlarge the pupils with the tool like this. Two clicks should be enough to achieve the desired pupil size. Once you are satisfied, click OK to apply the changes. If the pupils end up looking too large or if you want to make further adjustments, you can use the liquify filter again. Simply double click on the smart filter to open the liquify window. You can adjust the size and position of the pupils using the various tools available. Keep in mind that the liquify filter can also be used to adjust other facial features such as the shape of the nose or size of the lips. It's a powerful tool for making subtle or dramatic changes to a person's appearance. Here is the before and after editing. It's important to note that it may not work for everyone. In some cases, dilating the pupils may not be noticeable or may even have a negative impact on the overall appearance of the subject. For instance, if someone has natural dark eyes with the very small pupils, dilating them may not have a significant impact on the final image. It's very essential to consider the individual's unique features and characteristics when deciding whether or not to use this technique. That's it for this video. I hope you found this information helpful and don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel for more exclusive Photoshop tips, tricks and tutorials and hit the bell icon for notifications. Please like, share this video with friends and comment your valuable opinions and thank you so much for watching and see you again in our next video. Take care. Happy editing.